We told you about changes coming to Omaha's public parking plan. Well, the changes go into effect October 13th. The cost of parking at public meters is going up and enforcement times are being extended to 9 p.m., including Saturdays. Brandon Scott is in Midtown with more on how these changes will impact all of us. Mallory, the changes are for public meters here in Midtown all the way to downtown, even new meters in the Blackstone District, which haven't been installed yet. But it's businesses downtown, particularly in the old market, which will most likely feel the biggest impact. That's the biggest complaint we've heard in the old market is there's not enough parking. There is lots of parking. It's not always free. And that's and that's the way it's always that's the way it is in every downtown. Shelly Stokes owns Spaghetti Works, one of the Old Market's most popular restaurants. She's also president of the Old Market Business Association and helped create the new parking plan. Even if you have free parking, it's not free. You know, those those businesses are paying for it in rent and they're bringing that into their pricing structure too. Everybody pays for parking in some way or some form. We're just doing it in a meter. Stokes believes raising meter rates and extending enforcement hours will actually benefit customers by increasing parking turnover and creating more available spaces. So those customers who need to get in here quickly and they need to, they got an hour for lunch, just an hour. They can get in, get their meal and get out of here and it's going to help them. But what about employees like wait staff who have to park downtown every day for work? The city at this point has been very cooperative of trying to find some programs and some ways that we can give them uh, shared parking programs. Um, there is some talk right now that we will do some kind of prepaid parking where an employer can help out with that. Now, those employee programs aren't on the books just yet. Stokes tells me that the city's parking committee is still working to find a solid solution. Reporting live with photographer M.H. Danker, I'm Brandon Scott, WWT 6 News.